for the folks, Skates the Beast and Boy Crew Skill. This is the last part of the game in game number four, as we've got the Nuggets facing against the Golden State Warriors back at Chase Center. Now this part of the matchup is we're ready to have things on in between Jamal Murray and Stephen Curry with Contagious Carlo Pope and Clay Thompson. Michael Porter Jr. is with Aaron Gordon and Nikola Jokic is in the center. With Andrew Wiggins, Draymond Green, and center is Trace Jackson Davis. This time, it's a win or go home for the Golden State Warriors. If they don't win, they will be eliminated, and the Nuggets will be moving on to the second round to face against the Clippers or the Mavericks. Now it's time to find out and see what goes in. Stand nearby, I have a cross up here. We have a great matchup, so we can have it on our number commentary on the board. It's Terry Cruz along with Woods Rooney. And finally, we have it all that we can bring it in here for our last part of it, Light Ball. And let's get the game started on the road to Chase Center. See you all later, everybody, for halftime of the Crew Post Game Show. After this. And we'll see what happens if there's any changes. Let's play in the win, baby! Two K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA playoffs. Hey everybody, it's Terry Crews, and I am at Chase Center. And tonight's game, it's the Nuggets against the Warriors in San Francisco. Coming to you live here, and I'm also here with my broadcasting partner, here with Wood Spoonie, and of course, Lightball. David Aldridge on the sideline here will be on the court just shortly around the way. And with the great matchups in between, it will be a win or go home for Golden State Warriors. They lost three games in the in a row in the playoffs against the Nuggets since the first two road trip, but the last game was coming a little bit short. But we'll have to find out if they can get a win. It's just what they do now because they're, they're going to let that happen and they're going to have to try something again because this just hey, If they don't win, then it's over. And for the Warriors, they will win the face, they'll win the tip off, jump off, and we're ready to get started. Jamal Murray is on seven dirty. And Jackson Davis is on Nikola Jokic. Gordon is on Draymond Green. And Thompson, he's with on the air, air player inbound. As we have this, as we have Carwell Pope on him. And finally, we have his on the side of it. We have his Andrew Wiggins. He's with Michael Porter Jr. On oh, that start range, he's going to start taking some a little bit inbound. And now it's where you do. Takes him a lot of time to get that brand set at all. Here's Murray over Curry. That's off the rim. Draymond Green with the rebound. Stephen Curry trying to look for some answers for three. This one starts off with a great start with a three-pointer open look. It's a 5-0 game. Now they're really expecting by now. They were really saying that Stephen Curry really loves that driving effort. And the first foul called on Draymond Green. That will be his first personal foul, first team foul, to Verbal and State. Jamal Murray is really looking on the drive, and a new arrow shape, I mean, he's definitely wanting to get that one drive over. Every single step along the way, it does count for it, and it's not just the only, uh, it's comfortable enough to get that game back in. First trip to the free throw line will be Denver Nuggets, with just under seven minutes remaining in the first quarter of the game. He's one of the Canadian players here, guys, and this one is really like all for him, and he has been playing it for back in Canada, and now he's ready to join his Olympic team for the 2024 season of the in Paris of the Olympics. What do you think about what he will do? Well, I think he might be just going to the next level. I mean, Jamal Murray is really like up to a full pressure range. Team Canada, they're really expecting to see what they can do to get this one signed. And a second free throw will set in for Jamal Murray. 
He's pressing. Amazing player. He has us all coming in here for him. And his better technique is a better offensive skill. He takes a lot of time to have it all. Here's Curry for three. Two in a row. No good. 42 to Mohammed's ball. He has got his first rebound tonight. He's off again to Eric Gordon. Gordon tries to give it over now, finding it again. Now over to Jamal Murray. Murray finding Michael Porter Jr. on the outside. Trying to look for some cutting bound. Jokic spins it around and makes it two. Jokic has got his first bucket of the game. Five forces score as they are trailing by one. Stephen Curry up against Jamal Murray. Now here's Thompson for two. It's good. Ray Thompson with his first look. And now it's the second bucket in the game. Just realizing that how Clay Thompson really goes with the Kai team. About to dynamic trio, but looking to scope with another attack. On the drive, and good shot take here for Jamal Murray. He has his second bucket. Trying to reach that one out of here, and, that, and that's what you know about Jamal Murray was able to get that one here right at the, the single on the division amount. That's what he was trying to do to make sure he gets it at a time. Three corner can't get the mark. Aaron Gordon now finding again to Michael Porter Jr. for a throw down, and he has one hand dunked down. Michael Porter Jr. with his first bucket, and Gordon with the assist. It's just really what you say, Michael Porter Jr. is just trying to like, well, one hand dunk down, and just really a hard one, but they can get their big. Wiggins with a layup drive, it's now back up by one. And Jamal Murray with the ball. Wiggins look like he wants to get the team back up in front to stay alive before forcing it to game five. Murray now finds it over again to Jamal Murray. Murray finds it over again to Michael Porter Jr. Five to shoot. Here's a two for Gordon. And it's missed by Denver. Draymond Green off to Stephen Curry. Alley up. Curry. It's just going to keep on going now. I mean, this is really like a great pass off. You know, the same line was really like letting Seymour go by. That's great. Now finds the pass over to get a Michael Porter Jr. for the outside. Looking around a bit, here's Murray. On a finish, the drive will put in for Jamal Murray. He gets his third bucket. And it's Porter Jr. with the assists. They're just trying to make a close game in right now. Back to back switches already. As Seven Curry trying to leave an open room. Jokic on him. Here comes Davis. And that will take it in. Ten virtual by three. Michael Porter Jr. from the wing. Murray tries to give up to Aaron Gordon. Now he wants to give it back to Jamal Murray this time. Trying to leave an open room on the gap. Here's Porter Jr. for the two. This one will sink in for the two point range behind the three point line. Porter Jr. Porter Jr. with the second bucket, and that's number four. Just really got to make sure that Michael Porter Jr. doesn't get over uncomfortable if he has another way to get through it. Draymond Green stepping in. Two for Davis, and good! That takes it over on the other side of the range. Trace Jackson Davis starts things off in game four. He has six points. Well, you see, you know what Trace Jackson Davis has done. He's really like all into pressure in the range. I mean, you gotta give that one a good credit to him. Here's a three to tie the game. This one's off the rim, and we better by Clay Thompson. Here comes Wiggins for the shot, and denied by Gordon. Jokic now finding to get a board of Junior. Tries to slide it back. Now finds it again to Gordon now over again to Murray. Carwell Pope for three. Gets it to go. That will be a tie game for Denver. 15 to 15 to score after Murray with the assists. Time on goal by Golden State Warriors with 2.33 to go. Well, we're just going to have to let that one go right in between. You mean you just got to have to talk things over again? Might be one way to get it through. Just a little bit of a head start here for the Golden State Warriors, but Denver Nuggets are trying to get back into the game. If you're looking forward for our next part of the game, we have a next status for you then for the NBA as the Sixers will battle against the Boston Celtics back at TD Garden Arena. 
Then following along with the next game, as we have another one that's going to be approaching for you, is another team to call on the other side of it, as the Nuggets will try to attempt the battle ranger against the Denver Nuggets, as uh, the Warriors will be playing at Ball Arena. Then following along with the next part of the game, as the as another one will put in, we've got a great matchups in between. You know what to call for. It's one of the biggest of them. The Bucks and the Heat back at Pfizer.fora. And finally, for the last part of the game, we have is all for to remember for, well, they call it right now Wolves against the Suns. That's back at Target Center after Dallas and the Clippers at Clippers.com Arena in LA. That'll be the part of the second game after the first game's finish. Now we'll do substitution. Chris Paul's checked on the court. Along with Kevon Looney. Then it's Jonathan Kaminga. And oh, Jackson Davis with one and dump down. Now back up in front. Oh, just get away if you can let that happen now. I mean, that really is going to take some time off. Ray Jackson now finds again to Jamal Murray. Murray looking for some cutting. Number two, up it goes in. Jamal Murray with his second, third, fourth bucket of this appearance. Now here's Stephen Curry with under two minutes to go. Curry finds a pass to CP3. Chris Paul misses the first shot. Not just the way that the bench point starts things off here, but that one's a little bit too much aggressive to take the shot. A little bit too much here, it's a little outside and in. Kind of let that one cool over if he has another way to spread it down. Jackson on Curry. The bounce pass now finds again a hurry. Three to shoot. Three for Jackson. Another miss by Denver. Well, they're shooting a little bit hard on the person. They're not getting this one clear. And he's Looney. Up to make the dunk. And that one's stepping in for the two. They're up by two. Oh, uh, just listen to the crowd now. They love dunks. They want that before. Let me hear you scream. Now he finds it again, over to Exxon, no Braun, again to Murray, here's a drive for two, loses it, CP3 got the ball, and Curry will try to keep the eye open in, Seven Curry is feeling like he's a little bit struggled out that point, but this one won't stop him backing down, oh would he really feel the crowd stuff and Curry really wants that all. Jackson finds a pass to Braun. Now Ninji. The two. This one's off the rim. Solid before it's for for Jackson Davis. And Kamingo will the ball. From in the middle. Around Braun. No go. And here's a takeover. Here comes Murray for two. Sides it back. No problem. That'll be 10 points for Jamal Murray. 120 seconds. And seven Curry's up. Foul called on Reggie Jackson. That'll be his first personal foul and a first team foul for Denver Nuggets. Well, just really have to call for Stephen Curry. You got to finish the drive out there. Now, I've been pressing prior to us having to make the finish in there work. And let me say this can be a little bit extreme difficulty, but for Stephen Curry, really want that all. First trip to the free throw line will be Stephen Curry at the line shooting two. two. First three for the sense in for seven Curry. Now some new line substitutions for the Warriors. As right now, a couple players as Braden Brzezinski and Gary Payton the second are checked in. Watson Strawford's checked in for Jamal Murray. Good for the second free throw. Denver trailing by four. Ten seconds remaining in the first. Reggie Jackson trying to pull a pass to Stroffer. Five to shoot. Braun taking slide back for the two, and it's off the rim. That's in the first quarter. 23 19. Road starts off for the Warriors as they're up by four. Keep that one in there. They're lighting it up. That game will be the hard press of the time. 
And this is what they all expected now. Show us what you got. Road win. Okay, go alive again and again. As we welcome you back here at Chase Center, ready to start the second quarter. We saw this one before, and you're always expecting to see this one here since NBA 2K22. It wasn't what they did. That one seemed to be impossible for them to kick off the start. How did that really happen? Well, it's just what they do. I mean, they could try to like, let that go earlier. I see that one playing a game so importantly. They're trying to make that one feel like it's a great on, on a possible strike. But how that game is, it may not be what they're all The starting dudes in between. Brady Jackson, he's on Brady Brzezinski. Ben Gordon, he's with on Jonathan Kaminga. Jokic on Draymond Green. Then across of here for the other side of the range, as we have, is Strucker. He's with our Andrew Wiggins. And finally we have here, the other side of the court, is Watson on. The other club power player. And now here's another chance for Jackson. Mr. Two. And Gary Payton is second with him. You know, our offense didn't really think he was not going to stop now. I mean, there's a problem with that. You got to make that shot easier and get that one going in. Draymond Green. Williams in. 25 to 19 to score. Keeping their eyes ahead. While they're really nursing, they're getting a fresh day to go into the shot takes. Jackson gives off again to Strawford. Strawford, nobody to go. And Jackson for the outside. Here's a step back for two. Jackson will take it in here, and his first bucket appearance is put it in game four. Now, you all say what Reggie Jackson is. He's really like playing it for the best of his games. On his game stats, after playing here with the Detroit Pistons, now he's really like all into a better look of his appearance on his offense. I know he's really well into it now, but let me say this. You gotta make sure you have it all with some great connection in there if you got a great look. The three, what's up? And I will miss from the outside as Jackson will have his own rebound. You know, you're never going to make this one in there, but that is never going to let that happen. If this turns it over, then it's going to happen to be a lot of good to take off. After falling off the court, here's another one change as Murray's checked back on the court for Reggie Jackson. Barwell both of him now for Strauffer. Brady and Mazinski and Barry and Tate in the second are checked out as Thompson and Chris Paul are checked in with 6.16 to go. Jokic back on the court. Now here's a chance for Thompson. Up in the goes, he's in! And Green with the assist. They're worthy of making some execution here. They're really making this one. It's a lot of change off. And they're having it right now. I mean, gotta make that playable, good right? Here's Garbo Pope. Finds a pass, now finds Murray. Murray looking it in. Up for two. And I will send it in for Garbo Pope as he has his second bucket of appearance. 27-23 is the score, as we're coming down to the midway mark of the first half of the game. Chris Paul finally gets his two-pointer. And again, Clay Thompson with the assist. Now he really exciting this. Chris Paul, he's finally back in there. He finally got a good bucket. Jamal Murray finds again. Garbo up for three. He will answer it back, and this one makes it in for the outside. They're back down by three after Murray with the assist. Probably got to keep an eye on that one. But Davis Garbo put might be getting a look of his easy three point bucket schools. I'm sure he's going to get it to happen and go in. Off to Green, and the bucket in for Green. He's making another one go in. A lot of scoring attack goes for the Warriors. Off to Watson. He gives a go. Moving to Blair and Gordon. Bounce pass to Contavious Scarborough. Going now finding Watson. Looks like he wants more. Will he take it? Nail grab it back. Now finding it again to Garbo's boot. Looks again. Jokic around green. Tough shot here. Jokic with his second bucket. And it's Garbo's boot with the assist. 31 28 to score. And he trail by three. Just don't let him tell now. I mean, they're really having a good run. Oh, Draymond Green with a slam dunk down. And Jamal Murray now finds it again to Nikola Jokic. Jokic finds again to Murray. Finds a pass out of Contavious Carwell's boat. Oh, swinging it over. Now find again over to Gordon. 
Off the bounce pass now finds Jokic. Jokic, number two, stepping in here for another bucket layup. It's six points in this game, back down by three. While they're really are talking, go for man down, man down, but don't let that one take over it for real. Foul called on Nikola Jokic in his first personal foul. First team foul, but a great hustle of get on green. Now they're really expecting what Jokic is really getting this thing they've done. You know, you just notice that the Joker is really making some of his appearances. He calls that one here for all of himself. Can't let this one fool you if you can get that from far. Draymond Green at the free throw line shooting two. Another free throw trip for the Golden State Warriors. It's the first free throw for Draymond Green. Now with some substitutions on the court. Michael Porter Jr. and Chris Braun are checked in for Jokic and Aaron Gordon. Porter Jr. moves over to point four position. That's a new change off. Green's on point four. Kaminga and Looney are checked in. Second free throw is good for Draymond Green. Now you can all say for right now, these, his channel is called the Draymond Green Show. He's really as far as a lot of commentaries in between here to go with some interviews here. He, they all expected what they could really happen now. They, they really love that. They wanted to hear for Draymond Green to have that grit interview. He made a lot of great chat chat and a little chit chat going on in between one of the star players. Sometimes he definitely did an interview with Nikola Jokic. He definitely did go that many times here. And then the second one was the Eastern Conference player, Joel Embiid. Then back into the Western Conference, I think he was talking in an interview with Luka Doncic as well. I mean, he might be something in there if he wants to go for more. Chris Paul, the bucket layup drive. It's a 37 32 game. Here in the final three minutes in the first half, here's Gordon. Gordon around a step, and we'll take it in there. That will be another two for the Denver Nuggets. Aaron Gordon's got four points, they're back down by three. Chris Paul on Murray. Screen coming for Kevon Looney. And this one changes over, the region fouls called on Aaron Gordon. That will be his first personal foul, first and second team foul. Now Stephen Curry check in for Jonathan Kaminga. And it is CP3 in the corner now finds Green. Now he chucks it for two. Take it back. And another miss. They just really let that happen now. I mean, they really want to make sure they have it in there. If something goes with the problem, I mean, don't let that happen to get in the way. They have a lot of accessibility, a lot of time, and this is the access uh, point blank range. They could try to let that go in. Or Junior up. Oh, what a fancy drive he puts in now. Or Junior has six points. It's a close game between one point digit number. Well, let's see what they do. Lead or take over. Thompson for three. It's good on time. Under two minutes remaining in the first half. You now finds it again to Carl Opo. Carwell Pope now finding the pass over now to Jamal Murray. Murray gets the pass back to Porter Jr. 140 left. Here's a two. And no good here. Never missed by Denver Nuggets. Clay Thompson with the screen. Here's the takeover. And he's supposed to slam dunk down. In the center of the paint. Now it's a 42-36 game. Oh, uh, they really love Clay Thompson more. I couldn't imagine that one there. That was a great takeover with a lot of the fans. Quarter three for Porter Jr. And it's mixed. Draymond Green with the ball. Tries to give out to Clay Thompson. Thompson gets again to Looney. Looney gets over now back to Creasy B3. Chris Ball trying to survey the floor. Five seconds to shoot. Chris Ball up for three. And he's got it. Makes the first three pointer. It's a 45 36 game. Jamal Murray has 
Pass it over to Carlo Boat. Off to Jamal Murray. With no room, he will have it in him from the outside. The Blue Arrow makes a switch. He has 13 points. Well, you may know that the Blue Arrow might be taking a lot of most of his time for here. But don't let that one change over if this one keeps it away. CP3 on Jamal Murray. A screen for green. Up for two. Dab it back. And it's up. Hard pressure and a defensive effort for Aaron Gordon. And now here's the Davis Carwell Pope. Ten seconds to shoot. Halftime shows on. And Murray will stick it in for the triple. It's now a three-point three -point trail game. And Curry spins around. Fade a shot. Will he get it? And he doesn't hit it off that time. That ends the first half. 45-42. We'll take a quick break. Second half is coming up. Underway. It's now it's time to send you over to David Aldridge. Hey, Dave. Thanks very much. Steve, a good rhythm for you in the first half. What do you like most about how your team's competing? Just like the ball movement, you know, the drive and kick. Our guys have played really well together. Uh, we're trying to move the ball, get a great shot. We'll see if we can keep the ball flying around as we continue. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, David. Thank you so much. Stand by for the halftime show. Third quarter is underway. And now. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey everybody, tremendous first half. Glad to have you back. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jetsman. Golden State found themselves in a close game in the first. Their biggest lead in the first, five points. They didn't stop fighting in the second quarter as they maintained most of their first quarter lead and now lead by three at the break. Taking a look at the Warriors, Kenny, what you think? We have to recognize their pitch play. Sometimes we overlook the second quarter. But tonight, they've been the key. They just have a shot. We love the boost. Getting that extra boost. It's huge. And big fellow, let's get your thoughts on the Nuggets. Whatever their game plan was defensively coming in, that needs to change. Can't let a team shoot for a percentage of the high lead and expect to come out on top. It's on the coaches and the players to adjust. And that's a wrap. With the third quarter approaching, we now send you back to Kevin and the crew. You've been watching a 2K Sports Halftime Show. As we welcome you back here at Chase Center, we're about to start the second half. Take a look at the stats for Jamal Murray. The Blue Arrow guy just made this one in here with the great tough score angles. He only had 16 points, 2 rebounds, and 5 and 6. Yeah, you can always say Jamal Murray can definitely really well. But let's face the fact of it if you can get more of down. We start the third quarter. Seven Curry is with Jamal Murray. And New York is on Jackson Davis. Aaron Gordon is with Andre Mon Green. And the cross contains Marvel Pullman tape on Clay Thompson. And finally, Porter Jr. on Wiggins. Here's Gordon. With a sidestep into two. That's a hard one, but he makes it in there and he backed out by one. Well, this is one thing you should get down, trying to get that catch block in the pies, and this one really is going to keep that one at the all time for the one. Three for green. This from the outside. Forager gives again to Jamal Murray. For a two, and he'll make it in there. That will be his first leadoff for tonight. After Porter Jr. with the assist. A little different shot comparison between those two. While the better definition may be a little bit on the takeover chime, and may not be a hard one, but they might be leaving the pressure behind it if they can let that one go in by. Now he finds it over. Looks again to Carwell Pope. Carwell Pope for two. He will make it in. That will be the number bucket range. As now Denver is up by three. Curry looking it over. The screen gives it off. Now he finds Wiggins for three, and he takes it in. The other way puts it in bound as they're sipping Curry with the assist. They're just going back and forth right now. They're wanting to make this one a lot that harder and challenging, but that won't really change the effect of it because that was really a hard one. They're trying to make sure they have it in there. Good. 
Gordon with a setback for two. Doesn't hit off the angle. Clay Thompson finds Green. He will take the lead. 15 to 48 to score. Jamal Murray with the ball. Now finds Aaron Gordon. Gordon now finds Porter Jr. Looks at finding again. Over to Murray. Murray. Trying to let it go by. Finding Gordon. Five to shoot. Here's a three for Carmel Pope. And then I'll grab it back. Jokic up. Solid. The performance effort of a D for Jackson Davis. Now you will try to find it our way to get from here. As Clay Thompson now finds Green. Here's Green. The sign in two. And he will take it in. Never timeout call by Dick Bourne Nuggets. 519 left to go in the third quarter. It's a great this status of it. They're trying to push their way back into the playoff spot. Just only nearing down in for the end of the third quarter to just have that one half in. Half in, half out. I mean, I don't know if you could definitely just try to change it, but that is a hard one to do, trying to make sure they have it in. The better target is releasing it, and I, and I really am happy to hear that. When this comes in for a long, I mean, I'll be happy enough if they can have that one going in, right, find it. And now, for this one, if you already got tickets here, it's happening here in Los Angeles. This is the have another one to take over for you. We're ready to see what they've got. If you're ready to find out what this is next event, you'll stay tuned for this one. At this next event, we'll try to like keep on going with the timing comes in. And you'll see what goes in now. You'll never know for sure. As they will, this will be another part of the matchup right in between for these two. But the event's happening here in Los Angeles. So this will be the top cap of the BFTI A12. If you're in San Francisco, take a drive over to Los Angeles and find out what you go for. Now let's get into the game as we go back back into this one as new players are checked on the court and off the court. Four players checked out as four players are checked in. And for the Warriors, trying to make some new, a lot of tracking changement here. Kaminga and Brzezinski are checked back in. Here's Chopper, he'll start in two. Fires it off the mark. Kaminga got it now, and Curry will have it over. Here's the takeover. The pass to Kaminga. Oh, Najee with their tonight shot. Watson gives off to Jokic. Bird setback. Reporter for David Aldridge for Steve Kerr. They're trying to let the team go to enforcement. But this one causes a problem for them. And they're trying to let them answer back. This is not turning to be really well. I have no other confidence feelings of how this is going to happen. We need this one in. All for three, and for two, you might need to have, a, have it all. If you have it going, we're right between the range. Well, just need to keep it off going. I mean, if you get that point down, I mean, don't want really to keep on flying. Now Schaffer now finds Najee. Gives it back to Watson. Watson tries for three. And doesn't have nowhere to go as Nikola Jokic has another one back again to Najee. Here's the take. Jokic, sidestep for two. That tough shot puts it in here. He has his fourth bucket in the row. 54 52 is his score. Curry finds Brzezinski. Up for two. It's denied by Nachi. Jokic on a fast break. Now he's over now. This dropper for two. It's it. They are tied up. Jokic with the assist with 3 3 to go. They're battling it now. I mean, Schroffer, he finally have a pointer, but I have to watch him carefully if he doesn't do anything that's really hard and integrity. They really are doing this at all time. Three-pointer misses again for the Golden State Warriors. Now, they're just not shooting really well. I mean, I don't know what's the cause of this one. That problem is not going to take all of that choice. They don't want that one to get away with this, and they can't let that one to get away with that point. Jackson having a little bit of a difficult time. Here's Najee. Off for the two, and he's fouled. 
Jonathan Kaminga with his first personal. And that will be their number 13 foul called on Golden State Warriors. Nazika Naji trying to let that wings fly in. That offense doesn't take the carry of it if he does have more. Well, the better of that one, the offense is really like trying to let them out happen. I was really noticing what they could let that like that go, but hopefully this won't try to like affect it for some reasons. If there's something happens to them, I mean try to like give it off. It's no other way if you try to let that shoot it by its day and then by night, but it won't happen like most of the games. Currently they have to be some a lot of major foul calls. I really don't know what it'll take. Now that Watson's checked out and Chris Braun's checked back in. And the Warriors are making new changes here. As a couple players are checked out, a couple players are checked in. And a second free throw is off. Here's CP3. After a pass here, here's Peyton the second. Looks down fighting again to keep on winning. Up in a layup drive is good. Trying to make that one go back ahead for the lead. Ray Jackson now fighting to get the Jokic with the finish shot. Oh, the contact fouls put up on Golden State Warriors. Keep on winning with another foul. And Jokic at the free throw line shooting too. He just said that I'm not taking all of my choice if I lose consciousness with the shooting driving range. Oh, that is going to like take a lot of like a hit at first. I mean, they're not really like impressive with anybody that you can definitely just stop for. But don't take the pressure of it if you have another take. Where you're going for it doesn't mean like you get it in there. Jokic hits the first free throw. Now he's definitely really well at that point. Make that one feel like it's a incredible player, and you've always got to make sure that that Jokic is a joker. You have to give credit to him. All for his better choice. And the second free throw misses. Now that's tied up already. Chris Paul trying to look for some screen cutting. In towards the middle. The layup. No good. Reggie Jackson finds Jokic and now off to Naji. The three pointer for Jackson. Off of too much outside as Jokic gives it back to Braun and back to get an LG. Reggie Jackson trying to make a new change up. Six to shoot. Here's Jokic up for two and he will take the lead up by two. And this one will be a timeout call by the Golden State Warriors with only two minutes remaining. Well, it's just really going to make sure that one keeps on coming down. They're, they're flying it fast. Get that one going. Now they need to make sure how they can let that happen is go flying in. The NBA playoffs and 2K Sports is brought to you by Starry Lines. AT&T 5G. Connecting changes everything. And by Adidas. As we're ready to set things in in game five, as the other side will start with the second round, as we've got the lead spaced against the Bruins here at the TD Garden Arena in Boston. Ben Paul and Lama the next game. We have another one coming in here for you, as the Western Conference will be on the other side, as the Stars face on against the Predators here at the American Airlines Center. Ben Paul along with that game. It's a narrow one to take off. The Avalanche against the Chicks as they're back in Mile High in Denver, Colorado. We'll have to find out what goes in if there's a choice in between. CP3, three for Kaminga. It's good outside. Up by one. And after CP3 with the assist, oh, flying in there. That might have a great look in between. 
Here's Naji now finds again to Stalker. 90 seconds remaining at the mark. Here's three for Jackson. That's good. Jackson's got five points now. Then they're up by two. Chris Paul looking in, drives up. Good solid contact here for Reggie Jackson as he has it over. And off to Fierce to drive. And he's open low. Makes it in. That's seven points for Reggie Jackson. Now, this is what they all say. Reggie Jackson is like finishing it off the front. Probably. That matchup may not be like a turnoff. And all that says now, they're letting the team go back into the second round. And a three makes it in for Jonathan Kaminga. Golden State Warriors trailing as Reggie Jackson now finds Braun. Give it over to Naji. Jokic in the center. He shoots over Looney. The back stepper, no good. 30 seconds remaining in the third quarter. As big and second finds again a Pazimski. Looks for a cut. Finding Gary Payton the second. Oh! I don't believe this! Oh, this one the damn does. That drive is just the same guy. This one is like a bench pressing pointer. Like you could just slam that down. Oh, that's crazy. I was really liking that play. That was excellent when you start that off. Start your engine, just shut that down. That thing is to put up a ring. What an excellent replay presented by AT&T, the 5G Slam Kit. And Najee takes a two, and it will be missed again. That ends to the third quarter. Back to back runs in between the Golden State Warriors and the Denver Nuggets. 64 to 63 is the score. We've got one more game with you for the quarter. And we'll be right with you shortly after this. It's what they all just signed now. Just keep on living it. Keep on crushing it. Big time is where it comes time. And we have a moment now to reveal the State Farm Mississippi game. Now, I'm very glad that I was really seeing that going in between that. Ali Hoop has been playing really well. And he gave it over again to Jackson Davis. That was excellent to start off with the first half. They're making this one look clean and controllable. I hope you all enjoy it for this game. It is now fourth quarter. Stephen Curry, he's all on the drill and Order Junior, he's with Draymond Green. Dan Wiggins, he's with Don Chris Brown. On the other side, we'll go over the other way as Aaron Gordon, it's on Brady Pazimski. And in center, all saves for Naji. Hey Swift on Jackson Davis. And here's Jamal Murray, you will have it over again to Carwell Pope. Big think about the three. Oh, I don't think he was gonna make that one in there, but he finally makes a ball to sink in the triple range. Oh uh, look, the battle of this one here for continuous Carwell Pope, he just did not have enough room to go in there. I don't know what's going on, but you just really see that what's going in there at the moment of my time. Now find a pass to Braun. Rolls it over. Back to Carwell Pope. At the screen by Aaron Gordon. He tries to put up an inside of the zone and will take it in. Aaron Gordon with eight points. A 68-66 game. Murray now finds Kevon Looney. Over now to Wiggins. Bronze on the cup. Pass off to Clay Thompson for three. Oh, rolls in and out. Now goes back to Murray on the other side with under seven minutes to go. And now he's over again to Michael Porter Jr. Gives it over again to Brock. Bounce pass, gives it again to Porter Carwell Pope. Over again to Gordon. Around green, solid before its effort for a defensive set. Clay Thompson with the ball. Spins across toward the middle. Green for three. And this one takes over with the rebound. It's holding by Cadavious Carwell Pope. That's his third rebound of the night. Again to Carwell Pope. Looks it over now, finds Murray. In the middle is Porter Jr. He goes up. Fixing it. 
Michael Bird Jr. with eight points, 70 to 66. And Stephen Curry will try things again for the top, top of the hill. Right toward the middle, he's up, and the foul puts up on Jamal Murray. No bucket of one this time as it rolls off the rim. And now the next free throw comes up for Stephen Curry. Well, that drive is a little bit too nasty to take on the pick already. I mean, they're not really, like, having a lot of problems already. But that is not where you just try to start things off. Don't take that one away if you know what comes in for you. Curry, it's the first free throw. We always say right now, he's in the television show. He's definitely one of the biggest guys that you could definitely just say that he's excellent on the Holy Moly show. Yeah, I love Holy Moly. I mean, this is definitely what they all expect. But Stephen Curry does, he's making this great attempt to do the driver range. I mean, he's been practicing all night long before his new season. And that's what you always got to tell him right now. Got to get some of the players if you can play golf there, too. Ah, all right. I guess there might be in our way if they can do one. Hey, will he participate in the golf? I don't know if I would. <laughs> you think so? I say so. Well, don't even try to mention it. <laughs> Lake Thompson. Oh, what a duck! And it's over on Jackson Davis to tie this game. One point comparison lead right in between those two. Where are they all going everywhere now? What a fly. Murray. Over now to Watson. Watson gives it off to Aaron Gordon. The two, it's good. Gordon with his 10 points in this game. He's still not fighting to quit here. Seven Curry will now try to fix it off with under five minutes to go. Wait, here comes Curry with a step in faith and will lay it up. Now it's a tie game, 72 to 72. Well, that's because of what the field goal Ryan is putting in there. 57 for Denver and 52 for the Golden Sight. They really are trying to make sure that they want to like put an upset in Detroit. But I don't think it may not be possible that they're going to let that one go and score. For the shoot, Murray for two, and he will take it in here. Now we're set up for the Golden State Warriors, the defender, but the offensive got him that time, as Jamal Murray has an R1. Time on call by Golden State Warriors with 4.10 to go. They just really need to have some quick breaks in between. They really got to hold things up right now. I mean, if something just doesn't go in right, I mean, they really have to get that one scuffled in to make that drive count. And hey, it's not what they always expect to say, but that's what you always got to make sure of. You don't want to make that one too loose because... Uh, this is because they don't really like what they are supposed to be doing in their offense. I mean, you don't want to make that one feel like it's not even aggressive at all. Just make that one clear, if you mind. Yeah, alright. That will sound good for you two. Thanks. Thanks. Group Substitution Court is on. Draymond Green trying to show it off with the crowd responses here at 4.10 to go. Finds it over. Got a reporter for David Oldich. Mike Malone seemed like they're trying to fight in to win off game four games in a row. If there is another way that they can try to answer this one back, then they're going to have to find another way to try to cover it up to go to a strong defensive plan. You know, offense is really not being picked up really well. But they really need to make sure that they are really need to get that target range in time. Just like not anybody does this. Carlo Pope with the ball. He's over for three and good! They are tied again. Biggest change is off. With 11 for Golden State, as they're up by 9, but this time it's going down to get it more. Carwell Book now finds it over. Green with the steal. 2 on 1 fast break. For 3. No, 
still no answer at that point. Cromwell Pope now finds it again for a junior. He will take it and he scores to go. Stephen Curry trying to like lose it down. Curry now finds it over to Green. The dish shot for two. It's good. Another drive for Stephen Curry. We'll have two timeouts left to remain under three minutes in the final quarter. Off to get to Jokic. Origina now finding a switch over back to Murray. Just down to six. Three two players at all. And here's an error one for Brady Mazinski. Finds Curry for three. D3, three, no good on that one. And here's Jokic. Where the ball now finds it over to get a car ball poke. Trying to leave over to Jokic for two, and it's good. Back up on the lead this time. And Carwell Pope with the six. Just two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. And we'll miss again. Now Jokic has to get the quarter junior. Now finally again the board day. We're in again to Murray. Put a little bit of ball movement in between us two. But now it's stolen by the Golden State Warriors. Trying to answer it up. And here's an error take. With a layup in, it's good! Nikola Jokic with 15 points. They're really are making this one a lot easier now. I mean, he's just something done. Really got to make that one clear ball to lifetime. Up and over and pass to Thompson. Over again to Jackson Davis and he scores. Back in the layup in again. And now with 1.15 left to go. Murray trying to make his way down. Clearing down the angle is Carl Pope. One minute remaining in the fourth quarter. Trying to let it go. Murray for three. It's good. 83 to 70 eats the score. They're really on fire for it now. While they really have to do a lot of power, and that means they've got to fix it up. Time to call by Golden State Warriors. We'll take a quick breather when we come back after this. We'd like to remind you that NBA Playoffs and 2K Sports is brought to you by your local key dealers. A moment that inspires. State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. And my story lines. Now it's time for, for your presentation of the New Balance Player of the Game. Now on for this game, it goes to one of our big stars of the court, Jamal Murray. The blue arrow has that one to cover it to receive this one here. But they are really expecting this one on a hard target. That frame drop is a pressured way, but they're like, he can do all of his hard effort. None of them can stop him. The blue arrow, deep and short. Keep it short and sweet. Better plays for jo Jamal Murray. Clock way down and Stephen Curry will have the ball. 78, 83 to 78. Tries to make a spin. Goes for a step back. Trying to hind it up. For the two, it's good. Both teams now have one timeout to the remain. 83 to 80 to score. Stephen Curry wanted to show him some proud. Now he is. While well, they're really are noticing now, they just need to let this one bring here all day long. As for the second to last timeout calls by Denver Nuggets, he decided to make some one last changes before both teams use their final timeout. And now they're on the court. And 
Here's a take for Jackson. He's right over to Yeti Jokic. Tries to lift it over to Porter Jr. Jr. Giving it to Jokic. Jokic. Trying to find a pass to Porter Jr. He's up for the take for two. It's off the rim. Final timeout left for Stephen Curry. It will have to do is take the three or take the two. Well, they're really like trying to like find something else right now. I mean, if, they, if that misses the ball, I mean, that is just going to be a hard one tight. May not be what they're looking for. <laughs> well, I don't know if they're going to let this happen here, but we'll find out what goes in. Well, I mean, this might be a two-pointer. I mean, it could be a hard one for now. I mean, but what happened is, they're really are trying to make sure if they can try to let that one go in. I mean, this pressure's never going to get that work for and they're trying to let that one score in bad payoff because most of the time, they have no timeouts left for Golden State Warriors, and if they have the bucket in, they're going to have to make a final timeout for the Denver Nuggets. This is definitely it. If they don't have it in there, I mean, they're going to have a hard time, and they're going to let, let it go off with the hard pressure in there. Let's hope we may do one to have it done straight away from the cabinet. This is it. Make or miss. Time starts off right now. This will be it. Will the Warriors stay alive? Let's find out how will they do. A chance for a tie. Here's Curry for the two. Up again. He's over now to Gordon. They will have their intentional foul for the for the Warriors. But now the final timeout calls for Golden State. Now to Denver Nuggets. Both teams have no timeouts left. Nearing before 10 seconds of the game. Oh man, I thought this was gonna be a Mikey bucket in. I mean, that should have been in there. And I don't know what has happened, but this is not turning out really well how this goes with. Well, I was really expecting to say if Seth Curry made the three-pointer, that would have been a tie game. But unfortunately, it didn't really figure that it wasn't enough intentional way to be up and doing it. So that got too much uh, traffic out of the way. So at that moment, we saw him at the OKC Thunder speed against the New Orleans Pelicans. They move on to the second round that they will have to face against the winning team between those two at the Phoenix Suns and the Timberwolves on the other side. But we'll find out what happens if the, if the Nuggets win the series and will play against the other team between the Mavericks or the Clippers. Fans are on their feet. Intentional foul will put up on Jackson Davis. He will have to be at the free throw line shooting two. Stop the clock with 12.2 seconds. It's the first free throw, and now they're up by four. And he is the second free throw. No timeouts before the Warriors. They've got to make something quick here. Curry. Coming up for three. Picked up on the Golden State Warriors as Kaminga with a second personal foul. Oh, they're really a must be being tied, but I'm guessing that Carlo and Pedro might be just doing it on their own, but this might not be the day with them without any problem. Carlo Pope, he makes the first free throw. 
If he makes it again, it will be all over. And it's good. Last one for the Warriors. Half court and out of reach. And so, Warriors end their postseason here as the Nuggets destroy the Golden State Warriors 87 to 83. Now it's time to go courtside as we have David Aldridge standing by. David, who do you have on a side court? Thanks guys. Aaron, big night offensively. What is clicking for everyone right now? I'm moving the ball. I'm moving the ball, baby. That's a, a big part of our offense. Make sure the ball doesn't stick and that people making shots. It was really flowing tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. All right, David. Thank you. And that's going to wrap it up, folks. With that part of the game, Terry Crews, along with Bush Spruny and Flight Bowl. This has been a presentation of the NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports. Have a great night, everybody, and we'll see you all again next time. All right, thank you so much, and well, well, well. Golden State Warriors eliminated in the playoffs in the first round, and now Golden State Warriors are just meeting its bitter end here, and now they're in for the Nuggets are in the second round back again, and we're fighting in our way to get in it. Yeah, it's definitely what they all say now. I mean, what they go for is just how hard they do. But they play really well, I mean... They try hard, they work best, and they kick it off for the dust. Here's our David Adol statistics in between. 60% for the Denver Nuggets for field goal range. Three pointers was even up in between 7 and 7 for Golden State and Denver. Then it was 80% for the Denver Nuggets for the free throws. Five three points was only 10 for Denver. Then it was 52 for Golden State for points in paint. Second chance points was 6 in between the two. Then it was bench points, 24 for Golden State, 31 for Denver, then 7-7 seven and seven for the even ones, 24 defensive rebounds for the Denver Nuggets. Two steals only made for Golden State Warriors, but the block was only three for Denver. Then no, no turnovers to put it in, he only had four points off, that turned a little bit okay, but that one's not going to get enough to find our way in. Then four team fouls was picked up on Denver Nuggets. Then eight dunks in the game, nine biggest lead for Golden State, and time possession was 18-19 for Denver Nuggets. They have been hot flying right now, and they really are putting in a good look on their strength. Now it's time for three star players of the game. All right, thank you so much. We start things off here with a first star player of the game. I got a good uh, look at the feeling right now, and this one goes in between, as the start off goes in by, We've got Stephen Curry. 15 points, 1 rebound, 6 assists in the game, and now with only 5 out of 14 field goal range, 1 out of 7 three-pointers is turning excellent, and 29 performance effort was the finishing take right in between. Number 2 is Contavious Carwell Pope. With 15 points, 3 rebounds, 9 assists, 5 out of 8 field goals, 3 out of 5 three-pointers, and it was 36 performance effort that he has took it in there. Just had a hard one has pulled by. Just got to make that one clear to go with some number three pointers in between. And your number one star goes to New Balance player of the game, Jamal Murray. 23 points with a three rebounds and eight assists in the game. Nine out of 12 field goal rings, three out of four three pointers, and he only made, and made 42 performance effort, and he's gotten it through. It's great enough now that they were really turning it like they were being the biggest, better of his end. A good farewell for Golden State Warriors. They'll be back soon for a new season. And that's going to wrap it up, folks. I hope you enjoyed this part of the game. We'll see you all back here in Game 5, right in between Eastern Conference and the Western Conference, and with the other two of each in between the New Orleans Pelicans and for the Golden State Warriors. The Warriors of the team are definitely out, but the Nuggets will be facing against the winning team against the other team of the Clippers or the Mavericks. Well, this will be should be it right now because if the Mavericks win, then they're ready to move on to the second round to face against the Nuggets. And for the other side, the Thunder stick on against the Timberwolves or the Suns. This will probably be it right in between of those two. And that will do. 
Peace out, folks, for a while as the NBA playoffs in 2K sports style. This is Roy Cruz and Gangsta Beast. Have a great night, everybody. Peace out. Till next time. And be sure to subscribe to this channel. If you don't, somebody will. We're watching on you. Bye-bye now. Thanks for watching. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.